what's going on guys, this is Zigster from Zigster Gaming and yes I know it's a little bit later than I said I would release it but here's the video of our the next episode in my uh, building the program series. I've been sick and I've had PC problems and just Sony Vegas crashing on me and my computer shutting down and you know sickness. The fun fun flu that everybody gets so but I am getting this episode out to you guys. It's 11 o'clock as I'm recording this on January 7th. This is 11 o'clock uh, Pacific time, so 2 o'clock Eastern. So, sorry for you Easterners. Uh, you know, I'll try to get them out more regularly, but just had a rash of real life issues. But here we go. Let's just get right to it, guys. So, here I am receiving the first kickoff. So, I got this driver kid. I need to convert him to a wide receiver. I got to figure out what year he is. He's really good. Get, gets a nice return there. Here we go. Tate Forcier, man. His debut. So on third down on our first drive, there's a nice Y stick play. And here we go with the screen. It looks like. Yep. Great, great play. I love, I love utilizing the screens in the air raid. It's, it's really nice. So there you go. There you see Tate Forcier injured. I wouldn't worry about it because it's only a minor injury and he should be back and you know he comes back a couple plays later so here we go Faulkner drops back on the smash play apparently wants the starting job back because like he just bossed on hose so there you go that was a nice nice play so there's a play action fake and looks like Forcier is back so it's good so there's a nice uh, cross crossing route and we're gonna go no huddle I like utilizing no huddle if I have my opponent where I want them or they're just in zone and I can just pick them apart. So here we go with a mesh play. Yes, I believe it's a mesh play. I'm going to go to the X receiver. Pretty nice game. And I just, yeah, I just love the no huddle guys. So that's what I'm going to be doing a lot more of. It saves time and uh, it's pretty awesome. You do notice that the score is is 17-7. Uh, I've been skipping the defensive, some of the defensive stuff, because I'm not not just to be like, oh, I'm so pro, I'll just show you where I'm good. But like, on the defensive side, it's atrocious. I I've, I've been running the the three four, and I run the three four fine with teams like Alabama, who actually run the three four, and I've actually ran it with Oregon too. But I'm just oh my god, I'm terrible on defense and. These videos I haven't been that good on offense, but it's kind of hard when you're going up against really good teams. I mean, I'm trying to build this team. Like, do you guys like this series? I mean, I'm getting some comments. People kind of like it, but I'm kind of worried. Like, is it boring to watch me freaking lose every every game or, or what? I mean, it's it's realistic is what I like. I mean, I'm not going to win the national title because I can run a good offense, you know, and maybe, maybe um, you know, beat a couple top-ranked teams. It's not going to happen my first year. I mean, do you guys like this series? Just let me know, and uh, or if you, you know, if you want to see some other series like a Road to Glory or something, I was thinking about starting that too. But just let me know. I'll do whatever my subscribers want, and that's why I make videos. So just let me know. All right, here's Forcia on the play action, and he's running, running, and he gets sacked. Actually, he doesn't get sacked because he ran. But look. I said that I did not want this to happen, and look what's happening, guys. Tate Forcier injured again. You know, I I kept him out of the game for a little while, but the drive that I had him out, I mean, it was just like one play when Faulkner um, scored the touchdown on the smash play, so it's not looking good for Tate Forcier, guys. Uh, he was unfortunately out the rest of the game, and I think the indication of how long he'll be out will come up here in a second if I edited that in I'm not really sure so we'll see so audible to a run play here just stupid god I need to count people in the box I just try to get I <laughs> try to get fancy you know I mean my the playbook that I'm running with is pretty much multiple it has some air raid in it and some power running I think guys I'm gonna convert more to a multiple type offense where I actually do some one back and just rotate some pistol not focus completely on the air raid all right here's a double post play right over the <laughs> right over the defender that was pretty awesome but i don't want to be like 
make it unrealistic, like just change up my offense. I pretty much have a multiple offense right now. So it's not like I'm going to switch up my offense and have it not be unrealistic. I'm just going to not pass as much because right now the line that I have is atrocious. I mean, you'll see how long Forcey is out in a little while. I mean, it's not that bad, but I mean, it kind of sucks. So I might move more to a multiple offense because I don't have a line. I can't really pass the ball because I don't have enough time. And so, yeah, I think I'm going to move towards kind of a kind of more of a multiple offense um, um, from now on. So I don't want it to be, like I said, unrealistic. Like, oh, let's just change up the offense. And, you know, I, I have a multiple book. So it's not like I'm just going to completely change right in the middle of the season. I'm just going to run more out of uh, one back and utilize some play action more and not run as much out of the shotgun. So there you go. That was a nice... Nice uh, touchdown pass by Faulkner. Nice smash play. <laughs> I run that play so much. Oh my gosh. I need to get really... Um, I need to get better at play calling. So I'm not blaming it all on the computer, but like right now I'm kind of a sucky play caller. I don't know why. Like I play all these games and then like I hit the record button and I like instantly fail. So I'm not sure why, but I'm going to switch up my offense and there you go. Smash play again. <laughs> so predictable. I mean, it works because they they were in zone, but still, I mean, oh man. Okay, so there you go. Nevada's up 48 to 17. Man, I mean, they're a good team, and you know, I'm still a one star. But again, just let me know if you guys like this, because it's gonna be realistic. I don't want to. I'm not gonna play on varsity and like make a run with San Jose State to beat Alabama in the BCS title game. I don't want to be like that. I don't be like, oh, I'm so pro because I can take San Jose State to the title, you know, on varsity. I want to make it realistic. So, let me know, guys. So, here we go. Looks like 3-12 left in the fourth quarter. I try to run it, and I get pretty good yards. And that is the end of the game, guys. Looks like it was a shorter video this time, but, you know, that's what you what you get I didn't want to show you all my defensive failures 55 17 I really got to switch it up on offense I no man it's just not not going well for the Spartans of San Jose State not sure what I need to do I it didn't show for some reason I might have edited it out I probably did but um tape force is out five weeks guys such a disaster. I kind of jinxed it. If you guys watched the last episode, I kind of jinxed it. I was like, well, if Tate Forcey gets injured, let's take him out for a, for a couple plays. Which I did. He comes back in. I try to run with him, and he gets he gets hurt. Here's the player of the game. Some dude from Nevada. If there's any Nevada fans out there, sorry about that. It's like something. I, I couldn't really read it from here because I'm like watching a little Sony Vegas uh, window. But yeah, just like, comment, and subscribe. But seriously, guys, let me know if you guys like this. I feel like I'm just like failing it up and you guys are like, oh, maybe this guy isn't that cool. Maybe I should not watch him anymore. You know, let me know what you guys want. I mean, this is this is what it would be like if you were trying to build, you know, if Saban went to San Jose State, it's not like he would be a complete boss from the start. You know, you'd have to build it up. So I'm a one star right now. If I can get, <laughs> if I can get to a bowl game, it's only six wins. I think if I switch up my offense and not pass as much, you know, my line kind of sucks. So I'm just gonna have to improvise on offense. So I'm just gonna play to my strengths. You know, I mean, I have a pretty good, pretty decent running back. With four CA out, I just can't. I can't run. I mean, it's still gonna run some Mary, but I can't run as much as I have, just due to the fact that I don't have an accurate quarterback for five weeks. So I'm gonna switch. Um, switch gears a little bit go more towards a multiple offense so give me suggestions for series I mean I'm just gonna I'm, I'll probably do a road to glory maybe uh, some other dynasty things I recorded a uh, Alabama versus LSU uh, match with my brother and uh, so I might upload that we got to do a commentary track on it but it's it's kind of a <laughs> kind of a massacre so I might do some simulation or give you my or give you guys my uh, prediction on the title game maybe make a video about that or recruiting pretty much anything you guys want I mean I'm just starting this channel out I'm, I've loved the support so far but just uh, let me know what you guys want so peace out guys